I'm Jasmine Bailey. And I'm Katherine Beek. Recently, we've noticed some people were behaving badly. So badly, the media caught wind of it. And that's never good for anyone's <laughs> reputation. First up, we have the Palin family. Yes, those famous political people. The Palins were allegedly involved in a house party brawl earlier this month. But the fight didn't start making headlines until this week. They run for an office as a family, and they get into fights as a family. Alcohol was believed to have been a factor in the incident. Okay, no duh. The fight allegedly involved Bristol Palin and a right hook, as well as Track Palin confronting his sister Willow's ex-boyfriend. Eesh. Police confirmed they were at the party. Palin's camp has been silent. Next up, police say a man stole the identity of his dead twin brother. Oh yeah, according to authorities, he scammed Social Security out of a whole lot of money. News outlets took note when officials said the 52-year-old New York man named Thomas Murphy pocketed more than $500,000. His brother died in 1962, shortly after birth. A court hearing is scheduled for October 21st. Murphy could end up in jail for up to 19 years if convicted. And finally, we end on a doozy. What, you thought we couldn't get any worse than a Palin bra and a guy possibly capitalizing on his dead brother? We can. How about a man who allegedly tore up two golf courses with his truck and caused thousands upon thousands of dollars worth of damage, all because a girl dumped him? Yeah, that happened. It caused more than $50,000 worth of damage there. Austin Christopher admitted to everything. After a neighbor heard the noise and called 911, police nabbed Christopher in his truck. That must have been one bad breakup. And maybe one of the most expensive. The two golf courses are in Orchard Park, New York. Harvest Hill Golf Course says only one of its greens was damaged, and Bob Olink says destruction there was limited to a practice area. Both remain open for business. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out next week for another top three.